Hey guys, welcome back to another Disintegrator Films tutorial. This one's going to be a real quick one. So I uh, will be walking you through how to create an animation like this. Now, the use for something like this uh, is pretty varied. So you could use it in your YouTube videos or uh, upload it to Twitch. But the point is, <clears throat> we're going to create this using a... Uh, program called GIF Gun for Adobe After Effects. I will include a link in the description. Now the great thing about this is that um, this creates a GIF with uh, an alpha channel which means that uh, it's got the transparent background. Um, I have verified with uh, some Twitch streamers um, that I did some design for that this indeed will work for Twitch. So um, and as far as I know, GIF Gun is the only one-stop shop way for creating uh, animated GIFs with Alpha. So here we go. Let's see. So the animation itself is not what we are going to be going through. Although if you'd like, uh, you can check out the description here. And uh, I will include the components of this animation in the description for download. Um, what we are concentrating on is the GIF gun itself. Um, now, in order, once you've got your animation, whatever it is, um, ready to go. In this case, obviously, it's this thanks for subscribing situation with the astronaut. Um, you go to Window, and then go down here to GIF gun .jsxbin. This is the part uh, that kind of messed me up at first when I started using this. Um, but I am going to walk you through this real quick. So um, if you just click on this little uh, gear box here, it will give you a uh, settings box. And in the settings box, um, what you want to do is make sure that keep alpha is clicked. Um, and you want to resize it to whatever width the composition is. Um, I found that 1280 keeps those GIFs uh, a high enough quality and uh, a small enough file size so that uh, it's no problem to upload. Um, here you would change your directory that you'd like to save this to. Um, let's see. Let's create a new directory. A new folder. And we will just call this GIF Gun Animation. Cool. The way I would use this is uh, with just a single play option. So the idea is you would upload this and it would be an animation that's triggered every time somebody subscribes during a live stream um, or you would just want to play it once. Um, this particular kind, I don't think you'd want to do the infinite loop. However, you do have that option of creating an infinitely looping GIF. Um, but anyway, whatever uh, settings you decide on, um, these are the settings that I'm choosing. Um, and click done. You just go over here to click the uh, box that says make GIF. Now watch this. You click it, it adds something to your render queue and it begins uh, right away um, to render this into the folder that you uh, chose. Can take a couple of minutes and this kind of thing can happen. Now once that is done, I want you to pay special attention to this box right here, if you can see this. Um, it is a status bar, but it's all grayed out. And um, if you were to look at the folder before this is ready, before this says 100% done uh, or finished, you're not going to find the GIF that you're looking for. So even though you heard the render queue sound go off, it's not ready yet and this is where you're going to keep track um, of whether or not your GIF is ready. I had this problem when I first installed this and began making them. Um, it caused me to uh, give up altogether for a day or so. I had to text back and forth with the creators of GIF Gun. Um, I, I feel like maybe there should be a progress bar here or maybe just another pop-up window but as it is right now with this current release which I believe is 1.7 um, yeah, that's how you know. Then uh, you're going to get this 
handy pop-up if you chose that in the settings. Um, and then let's take a look at the quality. Check that out. And that is an animated GIF. What a high quality GIF. Um, and check out the file size. 6.03 megabytes. So that is a super small file size and uh, that's going to work for a lot of these applications, especially things like Twitch. Um, and the alpha is super important because it allows you to use it as a trigger and so that you're not going to lose uh, any face time during your live stream. This thing will just trigger that once um, every time somebody subscribes uh, or you could do it you know, anytime somebody gives you coins or you know, whatever the case may be. Um, just set this up as a triggered animation. I hope that makes things clear. Um, very important. Just check out the status bar that's on the GIF gun uh, uh, user interface. Super important. Um, and don't forget that. All right. So um, this has been another Disintegrator Films tutorial. If there's something else you guys would like me to cover, please just let me know. Uh, I'd be happy to do that. Thanks for watching. Uh, click like this video and subscribe for more. Thanks.